Hello buddies, welcome to the deadly challenge in Mordheim City of the Damned. My name is Game Knight and tonight we will be hiring one of the new DLC warriors here in the Mordheim Madness Week. I hope that you guys can bear with me that I'm going to hire another rank, uh, another rank 7 for zero gold in, in this challenge, but as I said with, when we did it with the smuggler, you can do that too, of course, that is up to you, but you can only hire one of the three, only one at any time, only one, you cannot hire the second one, that's just to make things fair, to be honest. And I, while I feel that uh, Jeremiah is cool and all, I'm leaning towards this new guy a bit more. So we'll uh, we'll check him out. I've already covered him uh, in my patch overview uh, video, where when I live streamed, we went into every single skill. So I'm gonna I'm gonna check things out, of course, because I. Yeah, I can't remember all of them either and what to use specifically. So we'll, we'll take a look at that. Generally, we want to increase his strength at least. I'm thinking 12 is the um, sweet spot here because we want him in heavy armor. Where is it? There we go. Armor proficiency. And we want that upgraded to increase his armor absorption because I'm not going to bother with his agility to be honest we're gonna make him a tank in his own respect um, wearing heavy armor of course devotion and he can get yeah so he's he's basically uh, <coughs> sorry from the sisters warband uh, He's coupled with them, so he has some of these absolute faith and uh, divine ages to increase his range resistance. What I want to get is some more, 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 not stun resistance, some more armor absorption. Where do we have that? Shield specialist. Hmm. Harry. Counter attacks. Nope. Awareness. Melee resistance. Range resistance. So his his um, initiative is very low. So he he will be going last. Almost all all the time, I feel. But I'm thinking this one could be insanely good. Increase initiative by five, charge ambush range by two meters, or crush the weak could be freaking amazing. And we can actually almost do that. Ah, we could. A melee attack that deals regular damage if hit the target gains a debuff that reduces critical resistance by 15%. <clears throat> That's very good. Though his weapon skill will be fairly low if we do that. We could build towards it instead. Because I, I really want 10 weapon skill to be honest. Will that gimp him? Mm. The weapon skill. Oryx Fury increases spell damage. And there we could, in his spells, get the Ice Storm, which is just awesome. AoE spell damage and reduces maximum current offense points mm. 
I'm gonna check things out a bit and get back to you guys. Okay, here he is. 15 strength, 10 toughness, 6 leadership, 9 intelligence, going up in alertness to get up his uh, initiative, 15 weapon skill, and nothing in accuracy. I picked guard stance. Guard stance ends the current turn. The stance increases armor absorption by 5%. Because that's what we need him to do. Uh, and that this means that we can level it up as well to get it to 10%. And then I took Wild Swipe. Just because I feel Wild Swipe is really good. And usually um, enemies do clump up against our people. So we, this should be possible to use. Uh, and I upgraded it. So usually it has a minus 25% chance to hit but now it has a minus 10%. And with this weapon skill of 15, it should be very interesting. Also, armor proficient, so he can wear heavy armor and increases the heavy armor absorption. I upgraded Ulrich's gift because it's just simply insane. It increases melee hit chance and melee damage by 20%. 20. It also grants immunity to all alone, but prevents the use of free disengaged ranged attacks. But why would you use it on a ranged? Yeah. Um, and then I took Wild Pack. Self and allies within a 5 meter radius of the caster grants immunity to fear and provokes fear on engaged enemies, reducing melee hit chance by 10%. So a debuff to uh, just keep people from actually hitting us. I feel I feel really good about this. I feel really good about this. We will replace Jeremiah. Uh, no, Radolf Leidenberg with Jeremiah Strauss. That way. Okay, cool. And then we'll head into into a match. See how we can how we can do. Let's just check out his equipment because. He should be wearing heavy armor. Yeah, he comes with a purple light armor, which is pretty dang awesome. Did we have any blue heavy? Only on him. And he does have armor proficient. Maybe I'll... I think this is actually better. Yeah, it has 30%. No penalties at all. And a purple great axe. So yeah, a bit a bit OP to bring this guy, but hey. You guys do the same, please. <laughs> I hope you're okay. Otherwise tell me and and I'll I'll stop using him. Stupidity increases chance. No. Perception. We'll give him that. Alright, let's see what we can find. Normal, brutal, hard. Let's look for deadly. Deadly. Or not. We'll do this, a walk in the fog. Each warband deploys in a wide arc from their wagon far from each other. Crush their will, so maybe that won't happen, but we'll see. ...to pick up the enemy's trail. Your warriors deploy from their wagon and spread out to sweep the area. In search of your foe. If you haven't noticed yet, it has a percentage in the loading screen. I just wanted to show you guys. Look in the bottom right. So now we can see how far it actually has gone. Yay, progress! We like that. Here we go. I'm gonna... I've been I've been told that you guys would like to see the setup that I do, so we'll do we'll do just just that. Okay, uh, all the wordstone is all the way over here, and we're up against a Skaven warband, which is always nice because they are so fast. And I did not mean that uh, at all. That it was nice. I mean. Jorgen here. Put 
Oldrum is there as well. Reichwald. Put you here. Dieter Haas can go there. And Heinrich. He's fairly fairly fast as well. Because I want to bring everyone up this way. Oh, I forgot to customize him, but yeah. He's okay. It it fits. Okay. No, it doesn't. <laughs> he doesn't have the right colors. <gasps> Dang it. Oh well. I'll I'll remember to get that changed. It's funny when when the enemy is moving sometimes you see the red reticle around our people. Quite funny. I I think. Let's get a shot here. I need these for no! Ah, dang it. For my thumbnails. Oh, yeah, and we have Captain's Order on her as well. Increases damage by 15%. Combined with with the buff he can do, Ulrich's Fury. That's gonna be freaking insane. So good. Alright. Let's head on over here. Where's their cart at oh there okay so they are all the way through here yeah I don't want to move too far ahead of everyone kind of leave it kind of leave it here take a dodge this game is probably one of the hardest warbands to go up against in the deadly challenge because they are so fast so you will be most likely you will be engaged by the whole warband within two turns whereas against against other warbands like the sisters of sigmar you will be able to spread out uh, the damage for maybe four turns before they actually arrive. The thing is though, with the Sisters of Sigma, they don't have any ranged units, so they will just be Yeah. Pummeling forward forward with their melee units like crazy. So you're kinda you're kinda up against up against a lot of a lot of guys that can that can hurt you. Whereas with the Skaven, there's a there's a fairly good chance that they do have some some ranged units. Same with Chaos and Mercenaries. Um, but but in general, you just just don't want to have too many ranged units. And and I was actually feeling like I had one too many with Jeremiah. Where am I going? Stop that. I need to go here. I think I can I can find that one without compromising too much. Uh no. Uh no. Can we go over? And down? Nope. Oh there's a cluster. There is a cluster I want to get it. I want to get it. Here we go. Go get it, Reichwald. Just ignore... Ignore all the rats. Dieter Haas is here. I think we'll send him through as well. Yeah, he can maybe even... Yeah, he can. Cool. Good job, dude. Good job. Oh, he resisted. All right, he'll take an ambush since he he can't dodge. And I think we're. G 
going to... I think I'm going to delay with Heinrich just in case they actually... They actually arrive over here because they could they could be spread to here already and then just run straight t towards. Hopefully they won't. Oh, uh, Jurian's turn. Jurian will be joining the rest of the pack over here. We'll take. We'll take an ambush. Because why not? Cool Durian with his long sword. It has seen some battle. Wow, look at the scarring on that on that weapon. That's that's pretty cool. I like that. And the shields as well. They have these battle damaged this battle damage look. Maybe he needs a shave soon. That, that could be good. Alright, they are not showing up. Hello! Slow-mo. Jomo. So, while we, we do need to get some wordstone, uh, it should never take the focus away from what you actually need to do. That is, destroy the other warband. Because if we, if we split up too much and just leave these guys roaming down here, they will die. They will most likely go down. Um, and that is, that is my main advice to you guys. Don't ever split up your party too much, because it's gonna it's gonna hurt them. So grants immunity to fear and provokes fear on engaged enemies for one turn. And it also affects himself. That is just insanely good. And we can also just do some... Uh... Oh no, look at the potential divine wrath at 45. So yeah, he's, he's not... 100% spellcaster, it will be like one round one started. spell each uh, each turn if if he's not in a totally insane viable position where he just wants to use his axe. Oh, I would have loved to see his... Yeah, see, they are already there. I mean, but what, what he was doing, I don't really know. Black Skaven... 278. He has some Elven wine. You want some cheese with that wine? Because he's going to wine in a bit. Okay. So, he has quite a lot of range on us. We have another Skaven Night Runner down there. This is my point. These guys will be... They will need to draw back. All the way here. Otherwise they may be engaged over here. I am... Thinking I don't want to... Go too far. See, I don't even... I didn't even make it all the way over there. Before <laughs> engaging them. Let's do... Let's do a perception here. Oh dang! I want to see. I want to see if there's a trap. Oh come on! This one then. There we go. Yeah, that's a trap. That's good. That's very good. Going to place black powder trap there, and then just uh, move back. 
to like here. Just so we have the edge. Um, because they do have the charge movement over us. Or ambush range. Charge range. And we just we need to counter that that in some way. Best way is by using uh, corners like this or traps. You can use that as well. Just to block off any charge coming towards you. And this is in case they just walk straight past the one I'm going to place over here. That's the plan, anyways. Jorgen going to corner himself, actually. Here. Yep. I'm wondering where he is. He may be near this area, actually. No traps. No traps. Sneaky trap. I really love Jorgen. He was he was the first hired sword we we bought and he has this eye injury, but it just it just adds so much character to the character. Old remiss. Old remiss never miss. We will see if I go there, that's bad. Yeah. I think again, it's just uh, a matter of trying to optimize where we can, where, where we can get the charge off where, where they can't. Okay, so he picked up that, and uh, then we'll bring, I actually need a new screenshot of him. Thank you, because he has a, he has a bow now. Bring him up, bring him up this way, it's gonna be, it's gonna be fine. Famous, famous last words. But then he can actually stay here, cool. Because he, d he does have backup in Dita. And the rest of the guys are really, really close. So it should, it should be okay. I'm gonna put Dita like around here. That should leave his reticle unexposed. Move up Heinrich. Hide. Hide behind this one here. You never know how many how many they are gonna toss at us in the next round. Or this round. They still have still have three. So I hope you guys are enjoying this week of Mordheim Madness. It is uh, it is wonderful to get this many videos out for you guys and, and for myself, of course. But I, I feel it's, it's the right thing to do once in a while. Once in a while. I can't do it all the time because time. But I will, I will at least try to get it done Sometime. Sometimes. If you guys like it, I'll do it. Okay, web of steel over here. This is basic uh, luring. <laughs> Just waiting for them to engage us. They are creepy crawling all over the place. Okay. Mm. 
let's see if he can wild pack and get him as well. Can he? Nope. The ones that are potentially going into combat first is these two. Awesome. Good job. And I think we're going to put him here. In an ambush. So we have every A single corner covered. Here we go. Where's he going to go? Oh, he's going to go in there. Hmm. <laughs> Yeah, okay, cool. Oh! Oh, he got to charge. That I did not expect. That I did not expect at all. Okay, so the battlefield has moved. Ow, Dieter! Oh, that guy's gonna come, isn't he? Straight over here. For Dita. If he does, the AI has been extremely clever. There's the leader at 58. So Gisela is gonna go help here for sure. That's gonna be her job. If I charge, I can sidestep, but Dita, Dita could benefit from extra damage, or where can I charge from? Can I charge from here? And I can, yeah. What are we gonna do? Radulf, Radulf, and then charge. We have the fear test. Oh, that is beautiful. So he has minus 10 to hit now. And getting demoralized as well. Oh, wow. Her dodge has, uh, her parry has surpassed her dodge actually. <laughs> wow. Well, that's that's what happens when you put more points into into weapon skill, and and it's actually fine. Being able to choose between either works really well, especially against impressives and possessed and the likes. Fear test of minus ten. That's awesome. Okay, it doesn't look like anything is going to happen here and if it does it's not going to be anything the guys can't handle i feel so we will uh, go help here going to get quick incisionized and she can't really do anything and turn Could have fled to make room for uh, one more, but we can still go the other way around here. This ruin thing, so that should be that should be okay. And now we have four guys incoming. Aldermis, we have the leader coming in, but I don't really know where. We're going to see them go th to... Aldermus could be, could be a target, really. He could potentially be a target. Uh, let's go for sort of like this. And hope. And then we have the backup of the other guys. 
Um, that's a 75. Yeah. Oh, man. What? I should have used the aim. I had way too many points for... I mean, that was dumb. Okay. At least I get to reload. Arm fatigue. Arm fatigue. Plus one SP to reload. Cool. Alright. Tita has get revenge. And he takes him down. Cool. He wouldn't have if I hadn't hit. Wow. War pistols of destruction. Mark of carnage. Lock trinket. We'll grab that one. I actually think the warp lock pistols are worth more. Just in case everything disappears. We'll, we'll have that. Okay, now we need to look out for Dieter a bit. And we do that by bringing him, bringing him back this way, I think. Yeah, here we go. Okay. Um, so you're just gonna, yeah. We're, we're wa waiting for the leader to act here, to see where he goes. Yep, 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 yep. Nope, he's going in there. Hello. Bye-bye. Okay. Oh, that's so cool. Thank you. What? <laughs> Ow, though. Ow, though. Come on. Dang. Looks cool, though. Ow. That is hurtful. Okay. Jurian, can you join the fray? Can you slide? Yes, you can. And we'll make room here. Like that. Oh, jeez. Did he get... No, we didn't get into combat. Okay. That was weird. Yes, I'll take away all your dodge. Don't you worry. Rune of Dismay and Demoralize. Rune of Dismay and Demoralize. Wow. That's horrible for him. I feel for you. Not really, but... Here we go. Heinrich going in for the kill. From the other side. I'm gonna do the... Charge. Normal charge. We'll be fine. Then just an attack. Good. It's good. It's good. Oh man. Oh yeah. He can maybe he can loot. 125 hit. That was really good. It does help that he has a purple axe, but still, I mean the the difficulty of the enemy does increase as well. Because of his power, so I, I feel it's I feel it's fair. I mean, I I do get some units that are pretty good for no money at all, but yeah, this this that of course. Gonna do a wild pack here. Oh, fail. Forty-five. Really not not worth it. And we'll uh, stick him in an ambush. Here. Awesome. A new round has started. 
I heard him. Oh, here we go. Okay. 130? Rattle, he can't really take that many more uh, hits, so... 79. So good. But he only, he only has two attacks, so that's good. I just want to check. Okay. Everything is there. Mm hmm. I guess I guess they fixed that. Maybe. Let us get some captain's orders on Radolf. Charge in. Yeah. He's he's gone. Good job, Gisela. Fighting claws? No, no. Grab that. This is going rather well. Fifty fifty-three they're at. We'll put... Why is it still... <laughs> it's still showing an enemy over there. Weird. Put her in the open here, actually. Should be fine. Uh, no loot there. And... I do have a bit of loot on him, but it was... Nothing big. Better better than this. I think. Ah. Okay. Put him there. Enemy turn. Alright, so... That was basically... The leader and two heroes. Down. I'm guessing they have two, maybe, th maybe three ranged with the, with the sorcerer as well. Could be, could be why they haven't really come by. Or they're just hanging out, chilling. Yeah, I'm not going to take a screenshot because I need the right colors on him first. Hello. Oh. Okay, there's a war guard over there. Hanging out. A couple of shards. Not, not worth the risk here. I'm gonna see if I can find that one though. Is that in here? Yeah, somewhere upstairs. If if we had stairs, do we have stairs? Do we have stairs? We do. We do have stairs. Hello. Thank you. A fragment. Oh well. Warp effect. Warp effect. Okay. You ambush. <laughs> Got an antidote there. Cool. And one there. That's nice. Thank you. I think we can safely say that Dita Haas has done his job and put him back here in safety. The safety of the cart. Cart of many things. 
That's a reference. <laughs> Um, so yeah, if, if they don't want to engage us, I'm just going to go loot some more stuff. Fifty-three gold crowns. Just please. Thank you so very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. I like it. Hello. Hiram's like, what, dude? Okay, so... Yeah. That pile... That cluster pile over there is gonna be our next target. Probably gonna see someone. Yeah. This one there. Gisnat. Hello, Gisnat. Two shards. Not, not totally overwhelming. Three shards, actually. Still. Again, need to utilize our short range here, or the lack of. Hey, that's mine. That'll increase his damage output in melee. Going through and up. Oh, okay. Hello. Oh, okay. Actually, not not stupid. Oh, I wish I could have used the swipe. But, we won't. Okay, so he got an open wound. Which is not really that good. That's pretty bad. Can he... will he... He'll hit one. Instead, I think Oryx's gift would be... Better here. Let me see. Two, and then... How many times can he attack? We can do two and then a three. So only two attacks. 95. And 83, wow. His damage output is incredibly good. So he can use a wild pack or an Ulrich gift every turn along with two attacks 30% divine wrath chance we'll chance it I like I like that fervor got fervor it's fine can still guard stance a new round has started she could she could just Finish it. But while I would like that, I feel that we need to level up our smaller guys. Because it's always the heroes doing all the damage. And uh, it's not always that good. Because they need experience. They need that extra kill. Let's see what his damage output is like here, though. That's going to be interesting. 71 to 79 with the charge. That's going to kill it. Yeah. No! Come on. Dude. Jorgen wasting all the buffs. Well, technically, technically it was me. Wasting the buffs, but... Semantics! Don't even get started. I, I'm a bit worried that he will go down, but then again. We have so many going before, so it, sh it should be okay. Aldermis could use a 
kill as well. And we'll try the two hander here. Forty one, nice. Didn't get it. Okay. Uh Reichwald. You take it. Twenty. And Pow! Dead. Dead and done. And enter. And they need to check now. There we go. That was fine. That was, that was okay. Deadly few, zero. Warp block scavengers, four. Radulf did really well. That's a lot of damage. When the Baron hears how you've decimated the enemy, he will be as pleased as a halfling in a pie shop. He may even send a bit of gold by way of gratitude. Okay. Jurian. 4 XP. Light wound on Radulf. But he got Fantastic. the most valuable. Gisela at rank 8. Nice. Heinrich, rank 8. I feel a lot of people are saying that the uh, young blood isn't that good, but I beg to differ. He is very good. Wow, that's that's a lot of loot. Look at the two clusters, five shards, and three fragments. Sort of fury as well. Okay, so we'll pay the warband. Pay treatment. But we all, we only have three days left, so Radolf will have to sit this one, the next one over. Um, but that's okay. I feel, I feel that's okay. With the Durian, takes fifteen leadership, and the Demoralize takes 15, twelve leadership. So we'll need we'll need to upgrade leadership. And his alertness. Uh, spell damage doesn't doesn't increase his uh, or decrease the risk of divine wrath to increase intelligence. So we'll increase his initiative. Gisela didn't get any points. Okay. I guess. Tita Haas. Um, grab alertness. Maybe, maybe intelligence actually to get some. No, alertness. Sorry. I'll I'll start increasing the intelligence after nine alertness. That's what I had planned. Increase his alertness because he's usually not in melee. Alright, and let's just check out items here. Five percent parry bypass. No. But we got a blue shield. That's nice. Five percent to his parry chance? Cool. Um, yeah. I'm I'm not gonna use the items that he found uh, that he came with not at least not switch them around until maybe if I if I find a uh, purple light armor I can use this one as well and the same with the great axe that that's only fair sort of fury will be fine for her very good and yeah, he has the Defiance Sword. Really need some blue... Blue uh, hunting rifles and cloth armor here. Come on. And blue bows. Maze of mis Misfortune. Miss Misfortune. <laughs> Minus one crit resistance. 
cool. No blue bows. Okay. Let's advance one day. New hired swords are available. Wait a second. No, t two two thirteen. So we need we need a bit more. A bit more. Just remembered I wanted to customize Radolf. I want the chain shirt here. We want I think uh yeah, the armored boots as well. Oh, that looks cool. Like that as well. We'll take this one. It's really priest-like. Scrolls. We'll go with the wolf's tail. Same there. And we can't really see his face. Let's find... The right colors. Um, nine, no, no. It's ten. Yeah, it looks like ten. He looks awesome. Just wait until he gets his heavy armor. We'll finish with with this. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed sharing this experience with me. If you did, leave me a like and a comment down below. And remember to hit that subscribe button. There. So, somewhere. Here. And uh, then you'll be notified when new videos become available. If you want to connect with me even more, you can check out my Twitch channel where I live stream every Thursday at 7.30 p.m. CEST. You can also follow me on Facebook and Twitter, which is my preferred means of communication. If you want to check out some of the other content I've done, you can check out the links to the right. There will be three links over here. Have a wonderful game night. Cheers and stay cool. For three rounds, that is insane for both the the back two back uh, slots, and there's one as uh, blight on one single. Awesome. Next day, a new mission is uh, available. And a horseman. I think we've come to the end of the castle. That was fairly easy, as he got blocked off.